Hey everybody, Jason from MichiganJason.com and today I am going to do a little bit of a product review. Um, I guess we're going to call it a pre-used product review because I haven't been able to use it yet. Uh, I've been searching for a, um, a pouch that's deep enough so when I go out in the woods with the rest of the pole cap hops here or, or by myself I have a big enough uh, space to put all the crap I find I guess you could say. So uh, I was looking at the Relic Elite uh, but that comes with um, a belt. I didn't really want a belt, I already have a belt. Uh, I emailed a couple times and the guy never got back with me saying if he can make one without a belt. So I um, did some internet searching and I found this thing called uh, Digger Supply Treasure Pouch. Uh, right here it is. I paid an extra $5 and uh, bought the Mule Pack, which is a little bit bigger than the, uh, the normal uh, Digger Supply Treasure Pouch. Um, but all in all, it was 50 bucks. Um, yeah, a little expensive, but that's okay. Uh, like I said, it's, it's pretty tall. You know, you stick a ruler in there. You know, it's almost 12 inches. Uh, wide wise, it's almost like a 11 inches, like a sheet of paper. It has a uh, some 550 cord right here with the external pocket that's pretty deep. Uh, pretty good to put all your good stuff in. Also has a uh, built-in thing for your pin pointer. Uh, it does hold the Garrett Carrot uh, the, and the Garrett the, the black pin pointer from the Garrett as well. I don't know about any other pin pointers. Those are the only two pin pointers I have. And it has like a plastic D ring right here so you can uh, tether your pin pointer to your pouch. Uh, also has another pouch right here. You can do what you want. I, I know some of the pictures show that they have a water bottle in there. Uh, I'm not too sure what I'll put in here. But uh, it's pretty deep. Take a look in there has uh, two internal pockets. Uh, one is one's pretty good. It uh, would hold the uh, Leleche or whatever the hell it's called, digging shovel, uh, knife thingamabobber. And the other one is um, it's about, I don't know, I want to say four inches by about five inches deep. And that will you know hold whatever you want. Like I'm gonna put my spray bottle in there. But uh, it seems to be good construction. Got two loops right here to fit, uh, looks like up to a two and a half inch, maybe three inch uh, webbing belt. Uh, all the stitching looks great. I bought it uh, offline from Colonial Metal Detectors. I go ahead and Google those guys. Uh, came pretty fast. I ordered it, I believe, on a Saturday. I got it uh, about a week later. So that's cool and I didn't have to pay um, that much. It was standard shipping. All in all, it cost me $53.90 with the shipping and the tax and I can't wait to use it. So. That's that. Back side, inside. I think it's gonna be great. So, see you guys later.